you gotta check the chlorine mm -hmm. level here. Yeah. Okay. And uh -huh. just put that in here. Okay. And you set this adjustment here. And always make sure there's nothing clogging the filter. Okay. Um, hi, uh, who are you? I'm Dewey. This is my friend slash roommate, Jeremy. We just moved into the neighborhood recently. Oh, you have? Well, <laughs> I, I hadn't really noticed. I'm surprised. We've been doing a lot of renovations. I'm surprised you haven't noticed. Well, I kind of had some bad shit happen to me recently, so I haven't been noticing much of anything lately. Well, then I could do the one neighborly thing I know for sure would help. I could take you out for a drink, so that way you can forget about your real world problems. What the hell? I suppose it couldn't hurt. You want to come, Jeremy? Um... Perfect. Good evening, gentlemen. Ah, uh, bartender. Good evening, sir. How can I help you all this evening? Jacob, do you go to the bar very often? Yeah, I drink every now and then. You ever had a Bloody Mary? No, but I've always wanted to try one. Oh, they're exquisite. Bartender, two Bloody Marys. Now. Right away. Mm. Anyone, gentlemen? Ah, thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Well, that, that is all. I will leave you all to it then. Have a good night. Hey! I wouldn't need that if I were you. Why not? Somebody sneezed in them earlier. Ugh! That <laughs> ah, burns real good. <laughs> I don't know, man. I've never really been drinking before. <laughs> Last time I had a drink, it was a simple beer with my father. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, don't be a puss, man! Try my Bloody Mary! Ugh, get that out of me face. Oh, come on! You know you want some! I said, get it out of me face! That ain't my thing! Look, listen. You stay out of this, or I swear I will kick your arse. Come on, leave Jeremy alone. Fine, you fucking lightweight. I beg your bloody pardon? You can beg for a lot of things, and it ain't gonna be for mercy. Guys! Enough! Fine. Fine. I'm gonna go hit the head. I'll be back. Well, thanks for sticking up for me there. Hey, don't sweat it, man. Um, say, Jacob, just so you know, um, Dewey is kind of a bad influence. So, don't let him get into your head, alright? You should be in charge of your own situation, not him. Eh, I don't know. He doesn't seem like he's that bad a guy. Listen to me, Jacob. I've dealt with guys like him for a long time. I know. So, just, just don't let him get to you, alright? Um, okay. I'll keep that in mind. Alright. Oh, it's getting late. I think I'm just gonna go. Yeah. I'm tired of this dump anyways. There you are. Stan? What are you doing here? Elizabeth's worried about you. She told me to check up on you. <sighs> I figured as much. Where were you? Why do you smell like wine? Were you out drinking? I can't believe you! Hey, whoa, whoa, Stan, it's all right. I was just out with the na I was just hanging out with the neighbors who had moved in next door. What neighbors? Yeah, the ones that just recently moved in. Did you not notice? Huh? Yeah, I mean, they were right out there. That's their house. Hmm. Lights off. Yeah, I guess they must be asleep. Dude, you're drunk. <laughs> I haven't had that much to drink. What's wrong with you? You've been acting weird since last week. Fine, man. Really, I am. If you really were, we wouldn't be having this issue. Come on, you know you can trust me. Dude, don't lecture me. I can handle myself. I think I need you to come with me. Why? We need to sort this out. 
Leave me alone! Oh shit! No, 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 Stan! No, 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 no! I never meant to do this. You were my friend. I loved you. How could I have done this? <laughs> Jeremy, what are you doing here? Jacob, I know what happened. I warned you about Dewey. His influence will taint you, as I see it already has. But, but this was all an accident. Dewey had nothing to do with this. Dewey has been a part of this from the very start. What the hell are you talking about? Dewey is a bad influence. The same night you meet him, you get a drink, come home, and then kill your friend, Stan. How'd you know his name was Stan? That's not important. You're not paying any attention. Do we- gonna... that, 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 Stop! Stop now! How did you know his name was Stan? Do you really want to know? Can you handle the truth? Could your father handle the truth? up to all of this. I didn't put you up to any of this, Jacob. Your father's fate was in his hands. Your friend Stan's fate was in your hands. And who knows where Eliza's fate stands? You leave Eliza out of this, you bastard! Uh... <laughs> 